हेलो डियर स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट आर नेक्स्ट पार्ट ऑफ आर साइंस चैप्टर नंबर एट दैट इज जॉइंट्स एंड डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ जॉइंट सो ओपन योर टेक्स पेज नंबर सिक्सटी सेवन सो स्टूडेंट सी हियर हैविंग वन एक्टिविटी सो फॉर दिस एक्टिविटी यू नीड वन स्केल इफ यू हैव वन स्केल इट इज ओके इफ यू हैव अ ग्लास स्केल बट यू विल टेक वन बिग स्केल देन वॉट यू हैव टू डू यू हैव टू टेक अ स्केल and then tie this scale to your hand okay then after tying the scale to the to your elbow sorry elbow try to bend your elbow try to bend your elbow okay but it is possible no after tying it is not possible to bend our elbow so why this not uh, why this is not happen why see because we are tying the scale here if we not or without tying the scale we can easily bend our elbow bend our elbow or elbow so student did you notice that where uh, see of oh, see where our body able to bend where our body able to end and able to rotate okay so these places see on this place our body get bend and our body get or our hand get rotated so what is this place is called so these places are called joints this places are called joint see look at to your sh shoulder to knee and to your elbows okay to your elbows see they are having both our body parts where they are having some places and on that places our two body parts two body parts get joint okay so where to do the two body parts get joint that places are called joints okay or uh, so these places are called joint for example our elbow our shoulder and our neck so our neck is joined to our head and to our abdomen our elbow is joined to our upper arm and to lower arm so these places are called joints okay so these places are called joints so students See and see in our body, they are having different parts of joints that we are going to study in this point uh, in this video. So, if our body has no joints, has no joint, then what will happen? If our body has no joint, then we cannot move our body parts. Correct? If see, here we joints not going to be, then we can't move our legs. If elbow is not going to be. so we cannot bend our hand and we cannot rotate our hand also so joints are very important in our body so what exactly joint together at right? these joints okay so uh, so first press your finger press your fingers okay and again against the top of your head or press your finger again the top of your head like this way okay face Nose, nose on the neck. Uh, see here, having uh, here also. Press, press your fingers on the shoulder, on your hands, on the legs. Okay, and including on the fingers also. You can. So, did you get a feel of something hard pressing? See, ah, uh, press. करने के बाद आपको कोई hard part लगा क्या आपके body में यहाँ पे hard part लगा? Yes. means this hard part hard part is called bones these are our bones correct these are our bo bones so these these bones cannot be bent these bones cannot be bent so how do we bend our elbow so how do see elbow here also having our bone and bone cannot be bent so hum bone uh, bone bend nahi hota fir bhi hum hamara elbow kaise hilate hain Correct. So it is not one long bone from the upper arm to our wrist. Okay. So see. So this is our upper arm bone having here, and this is our lower arm. It joined to our wrist. Okay. Okay. This is the elbow. This is our upper arm bone and bone, and this is our lower arm bone. And because of these two bones, we can easily bend our elbow. and so this is called joints these are this place is called joints so the so student let's see the different joints that are present inside inside in a body okay so first again see the second activity 
so for this you have to uh, so for this second activity you have to take a roll of a, uh, if you have paper then roll the paper okay into cylindrical shape like this way okay then take a ball ball if you have ball or any uh, lid bottle lid then what do you have to do you have to place this uh, cylindrical shape of a paper into the ball okay like this way oh, okay understood same thus the ball rotated freely see thus the ball we can i can also easily rotate my hand what i did here i i i, I took one uh, papers paper and i'll roll it okay and then i will place this paper into the into my hand and easily i can rotate my hand okay easily i can rotate my hand so does the paper cylindrical also rotate so paper is also rotating yes yes when i am rotating my hand the after that that the paper is also rotating very easily i can easily rotate the paper now imagine that paper cylindrical is your arm and the ball is its end what do you have to imagine you have to imagine this this paper is your hand and this ball is your this ball is your end its end ball kya hai iska paper ka end hai okay see look at in your figure so the ball ball is like the uh, ball is like the part of the shoulder ball is like the part of shoulder see look at here also having one ball ball shape on our shoulder and this is a hand okay when we are rotating our uh, shoulder like this uh, that time also our hand also get rotate we can easily rotate our shoulder see it's like a bowl shape bowl okay bowl our shoulder is like a bowl shape okay so student the rounded end of one bone fits into the cavity of the other bone uh, such joints also movements in all direction so these rounded shown of our bone is joint into the cavity so uh, see student uh, stay uh, or press your bone of your shoulder you will find some one bowl shape to your uh, bone okay can you name another such joint you can think of so this is called uh, so student this is called ball and socket joint ball and socket look at in the figure see having there a ball and socket joint okay so next is the joint where our neck see next joint is called pivotal joint so first we have study about ball and socket joint ball b a w l ball s o c k e t socket ball see this is shoulder bone is called ball shoulder joint is called ball and socket joint so second joint is pivotal joint second is the pivotal joint the joint where our neck joins the head so where the joint where our neck is joined to our head is a pivotal joint it is called pivotal neck is joined to the into uh, neck is joined to a head the joint is called pivotal joint our head it allows us to bend our our head forward and backward and turn the head to our right or left so this pivotal joint allows us to bend our neck okay our and forward bend our neck forward and back, backward and to her right and to left okay is pivotal joint ki wajah se hum hamara neck forward bhi bend kar sakte hai aur backward bhi bend kar sakte hai aur left mein bhi dekh sakte hai aur right mein bhi dekh sakte hai okay so so these so for this movement we can use we are using our pivotal joint in pivotal joint a cylindrical bone rotated in a ring in this joint a cylindrical bone is like a cylindrical shape cylinder shape cylinder shape or a cylindrical shape bone is rotated in a ring is rotated in a ring it is rotating in a ring okay so second joint name is a pivotal joint then third joint is a hinge joint open and close a door a few times when you are opening a door and sorry opening a door and closing a door okay it's you are doing it's few times 
observe the hangs of the door carefully so on the door also they are having some hangs or they are having some joints okay having their metal joints okay so they allow the door to move back and forth so because of this hang joint a door easily uh, open and closed okay they are on the see observe at your home on your door they are having some joints so these joints are called hang joints so student uh, see in your textbook activity 3 activity 3 see uh, they are having one cylindrical shape okay direction of movement allowed by hang joint like joint see let us look at the kind of movement allowed by a hang make a cylinder with a cardboard or thick chart paper i shown in the figure what you have to do you have to take a paper and make a cylindrical shape of that paper like this way attach a small pencil to the cylindrical by pricking it then take one pencil or pen and attach that pencil okay like this way prick or ah, okay sorry student like this way hmm. and uh, hmm, like this way okay and because see then what you have to do you have to allow this this pencil to rotate like this so it will rotating yes or no yes so it is allow movement like a hang so it is allowing movement like a hang see make a hollow half cylinder from cardboard such that see what you have to do you have to take one paper then make a one hollow cylindrical shape of this paper then uh then uh,